Hey guys, welcome. Oh, try and get comfy. Where's my pencils? Thank you. No point looking, mitts. There's no treats. You'll have to wait. Hi Jennifer. Hi Louise. Hi Ashley. Welcome. Admiral Catherine is Ashley, if anybody's, uh, if they don't know. Hello, hello. Right, I I'm carrying on with this picture from yesterday. I thought I'd do his hair, uh, if that's okay with everybody. Let me turn that glare off a little bit. Back up there. Thank you. If I zoom in, that'll take the light off. She says, I'm trying to keep the light on picture for me, but not glare out for you. Because I'm in a dark corner, believe it or not. <laughs> I know I've got sun shining behind me and I've got lamp here that seems bright on the table. But no, I'm in a corner and I'm dark. <laughs> hey, Wilson, welcome. Hello, Sherry. Hi, Robin. Hi, Chica. Hi Boots. Anybody else? Hi Della. Welcome sweetie. Hi everybody. <laughs> Thank you Ashley. Hmm. Who else? Nobody else so far. So how is everybody? And did you enjoy the wonderful weekend? I did. Lots of fun. As soon as I've finished my picture and I can post it, then I'm going to thank everybody who organised and who streamed and so forth and so forth. Hi Carola, welcome. I just didn't want to do it today because I didn't want it to look like I were copying everybody else. Thank you, Sherry. It's my first time doing a man, and I also went for brown eyes instead of my usual blue or green. Oh, skin's playing up again. Um, ignore it. Yeah, and I'm really happy how it's come out. I'm going to do him a dark brown hair. That's why I've done him a light brown-ish eyebrows to match his hair, uh, his eyes rather, not his hair. I've done some more of the leaves and acorns today while I was sat doing nothing. It were, it were awesome, lots of fun. Oh, you're welcome, Ashley. I enjoyed it. Yes, uh, you did, Wilson. You did. She's after treats again. She starts every time I, I start the stream. She's been laid asleep all day. Not a peep out on her. But the minute I pressed the computer to start up, she were there. Thank you. I keep trying to put more shading in, but I don't want him to end up being brown, if you know what I mean. I'm still not fully happy with it and there's still a lot of tooth so I can still mess mess about it a bit more uh, I'm just not sure of doing rugged features I'm, I've only just learned how to do women this past six months so I'm not sure exactly where I'm supposed to put the shade in but to me it don't look finished yet but he will do he will at some point when I've done fiddling. <laughs> um, I've been using polychromous pencils as you know but I did revert to um, the beige sienna and uh, I think it were rosy beige to try and smooth it out a bit and 
just beige from the Prismas. But I think it's, it's sent it a bit too light in areas, so I've still got to fiddle. And you know me, a picture's never done. It can always be adapted and changed. Let me take it out at light a little bit more and then you'll not see the glare on the paper. And my chat is so far behind, what's going off? <laughs> I think I've froze as well. Somebody to speak to make us think I've froze after Heather spoke. No, it's not moving. I'm not getting any more chat. Have I got to refresh? Oh, no, there's Della. Oh my God, how fast chat behind then? <laughs> uh, well, yeah, it probably looked too light then when I've done his hair. We shall have to see. Yeah, right, I'm going to grab some dark browns then. So, got burnt umber. Uh, put a bit of red tone in with burnt sienna. And this is my thinking stage. Uh, right. What's that one? Dark sepia. I'm going to need that to darken the browns. See, I love the polys, but there's not a very big selection of browns. And what there is, they seem to be close together in tones. <laughs> The Van Dyke, ah. and then I want a light, so we'll go raw rumba. Right, let's try them. You're here, yeah. My chat is so far behind, so I'm sorry, guys. If you ask me something, don't think I'm ignoring you. I have to wait for it to catch up. Oh, you didn't manage to get any pictures sherry well the hashtag is going for the full month of september so you still got time to do some if you wish and isn't it funny how majority on us have gone for christine karen pictures how bizarre it's as though we were all in tune with each other thinking the same thing right I'm going to have to start and put some dark sepia down first to where I want my darker areas. So I'm going to come in here. Again, I only do light coats, guys, and I build it up so it will take some doing. And I don't flick flick at this stage either, so. Because my coats is too light. Fill it in first. And it's our, I don't know if it's the same in other countries, but in the UK we've got a bank holiday today. So it's been a rest day for everybody. Apart from Liam, Liam's still had to go to work. Because food shops, they work far on, far off. So if it falls on a day when you're supposed to be at work, it's not classed as an holiday for you. So he wasn't impressed because it's fell on the bank holiday for him to work. <laughs> Bruce finished now. He finished um, two hour, an hour and a half ago. 
almost two hours. So now he's relaxing. And I think it's the first bank holiday we've had in a long time where we haven't had rain. We always say, oh, you can tell it's bank holiday, it's raining again. But no, today we've had sun out. It's been cold. It's only been 16 degrees Celsius here today. But it's been nice to have sun out. Right, so if I, before I go on any more, check all my pencils in these, this one area make sure I've picked good tones this one is burnt umber that I am putting straight over the dark sepia very light I know I've got my pencil up right and it may look like I'm pressing umber I'm not it's still very light Uh, hi Nana, welcome, happy bank holiday, happy Monday. <laughs> What's the exquisite flowers, is that a book? Which artist is that one Della? I don't think I've heard of that one. Is it a book or a PDF you've bought? Yeah, you've had sun out as well. I did look at the map, Nana, and it didn't show any rain anywhere today, which is very unusual. So you had a nice walk out, did you? <laughs> oh, poor Sasha. Did she get mucky? The rivers round here, they're almost black. It's time they cleaned them out again. That was burnt umber. Next, I'm going to go with the Van Dyke brown. Change the tone again. It's our back book by. Oh, I've not heard of that person before. Virginie Gouillard. I'm oh, uh, hopeless with names. Oh, it sounds beautiful, Della. No, I've not heard of that one. I'm very blessed to have these pencils. Thank you, Sherry. Uh, I wouldn't have had them if it weren't for a, being a nice gift from Kenny when I first started the stream. So, yes, I'm very blessed.
So that's showing any colour yet. <laughs> Do I need to zoom in a little bit more? See, I think you're blessed having the old binds because they're so expensive and they're hard to get here. I think they've just started selling them on Jackson Art, but they're way out of my price range, so I don't look. Right, I'm going to put some red in now. And every time um, the pencil rubs over, because I'm doing light uh, layers, I'm still going over the areas I've already coloured and every time it finds a gap it puts a little bit of that colour in it so it changes the brown that little bit every time now you don't get this way um, Prisma pencils because from being uh, more waxy and mushy all it will do is change the colour you're not layering different if you think of uh, paint where you've got an opaque and you've got a um what's the other word come on brain translucent well i think uh polys as being the translucent and prisoners being opaque so with polys you're layering color on top of color but it's not changing You can still see the under colour, if you know what I mean. I think I will zoom in a little bit more because that's not very clear, is it? There we go. Hi, April. Welcome. Yeah, so every time I go over somewhere I've already coloured, it will find the littlest of gaps and just fill it without mushing the colour I've already put down. That's why I love polish so much for doing hair or anything else that I want the original colours to show through. take this red tone just up into the top I'm not going far because I want to start from the dark to light again over this way and I've got raw umber You won't swap your polys for albines. Oh, that's good to know then. <laughs> I don't need to keep um, 
being jealous that everybody's got all these brilliant pencils that they keep talking about all the time. <laughs> Hi Linda, welcome. So that, that's now bringing a gold tone into the um, into his hair. I think my lamp's interfering with my computer because it's making the picture do funny things. So I've moved it out again. No, never late, sweetie. Never late. Any time's good with me. How are you doing today? Picture's clearer on me other monitor than it is on my laptop. And if this edge ends up where it's got too much of a golden tone I can come back in with the... Uh, you'd think I'd know names of these by now. Burnt Sienna and redden it up a bit more again. <sighs> Thank you, Nana. about the same Kenny now it's turning colder but yeah we're good both on us hopefully you'll manage to um, catch up with some sleep because I bet you lost quite a bit over the weekend while the colorathon were going on I'm opposite. I go for so long and then my medication ends up knocking me out so I don't end up losing so much sleep now. Not like last year when I'd got the insomnia bad. Back to the burnt sienna. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. I forgot about ba that Bailey wearing you out as well.
I'm working my way back up the pencils now. So, Van Dyke Brown. Hi Rochelle! That's alright sweetie, I hope Paul goes well with doctors. And thank you for the thumbs up. I may sound like I'm pressing on, I'm not. I'm moving it fast in an area but I'm barely touching the paper. I'll show you over here, look. That's what I'm doing. You can see I'm at, it's not showing any colour, is it? That's where I'm, how light I'm colouring. If you end up pressing on, trying to get your pigment to go deeper straight away, you're going to ruin the tooth and then you've got no layers to build your colour up. So that's why we do it very light with lots of layers. Hi Kirsty. Thank you. Ah, oh, you can see a stubble line though. <laughs> It's five o'clock shadow. Tumba.
have to keep looking at other monitors. Stop looking at laptops, it looks crap. taping it down but then I won't be able to move it around he looks like he might have been out of a Disney film or something doesn't he Hi <laughs> Ashley, enjoy your lunch. <laughs> Have you got some bad weather coming in again, Della? to dark sepia and I'm not going all over this time just darkening underneath here Darken this that's curling into his face. like that. So a little bit more red tone.
Hi Mona, welcome. So I want to come across to this flick bit now, dark sepia. Burnt umber. And I grab. Sienna. <sighs> oh, no, that's worth slump weather. And how close is the fire risk? I hope you've got somewhere safe to go. My chat is so far behind, I'm sorry guys. Roar on the
Thank you, Kirsty. Oh yes, the wonderful toddler stage. <laughs> back again. Oh, I haven't done that back bit. Hang on. Jump in the gun. You two go back over there. I've done the one. Need. Remember again, I've forgot this one that I put the grey down on. Sepia, rather. Not grey. See you <laughs> No, I've not used Messenger for nearly four weeks, so I can't tell you, Kenny, but maybe somebody else can. That sounds really strange. Perhaps uninstall it and reinstall it, see if it's got a glitch. I know during stream yesterday, so, um, somebody called Marilyn said she was going to message me through fa Facebook Messenger, but I haven't received anything yet, so that could be why, if it's playing up. 
thought she'd forgot. Just going with the sepia again where I want the darkest parts. three strands at a time, see if I can remember what I'm doing this time instead of forgetting half on it. Sorry, got burned on the And then Van Dyke Brown. Yes, I love the polis for. Uh, I was saying at the beginning, Kenny, I wish they had more selection of browns in them though. Sherry said I were blessed to have these pencils and I said yes I'm very blessed because we're out the wonderful gift from you Kenny I want to have these pencils and it's so true I spend that long saving for something half the time it ends up being a no-go Burnt Sienna. Hey Patty! <laughs> Thank you Robin. I don't know, I hadn't asked him. <laughs> yeah, Kirsty. <laughs> He's got a big mirror on, on, on his wall. <laughs>
and it'd be like uh, Queen out of, is it Queen? Oh, is she just bad stepmother? We keep saying mirror, mirror on the wall. I think it's stepmother, isn't it? Uh, I think he stands in front of his mirror, keeps saying that. <laughs> Hi Jodie, welcome sweetie. And raw umber. I'm just making sure I've not missed anything. Are you talking to me, Patty? Because my legs are feeling good today. Okay, Corolla. Right, I'm going to work back up. So, burnt sienna. She really should, Kenny. Seems like she's been at it for months. Pardon? Seven. Why? So she threw away my garlic bread and thinking of Audrey. Right, well, you said, you said that when we were knackered anyway, didn't you? You said you think yeah. yeah. Right. Well, you order for you unless, and I'll order for me and Dad. Right. Then it doesn't tempt you your money. Okay, doggy. Where have I been done us? Right. 
about to order a new part for the cooker because every time I were trying to use it, it had worked for um, around 10-15 minutes and then it would turn into a furnace and get mega hot and burn everything to a crisp. So I think the thermostat is playing up in it, so we've ordered a regulator and a thermostat. Only it can't get here for three weeks, so now we're having to take it in turns on ordering takeaway to tide us over. Such are the joys of life. At least it's not gone at Christmas like it did not last Christmas, Christmas before. It's very hard getting takeaway on over Christmas. <laughs> Back to Van Dyke Brown. I don't know if you can hear her or not, but Mitz is snoring under the table. She's getting rather loud. Uh, it's alright, Kenny. Um, the fan has got a flabby aorta. Uh, 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 why is it an enlarged aortic valve or something or other? Um, I just call it a flabby bit. So we had a phone call com uh, consultation uh, on the twenty seventh. When was that? Tuesday? Where? Wednesday? Can't remember. And the. Uh, Cardiologist, cardiologist talked him through what it were about and that um, it's not at a danger stage as yet so they're gonna keep scanning him and monitoring him but um, they've sent out a like a wristband thing that he has to switch on and it does his blood pressure twice a day and if it goes over um, 132 over 80 then he has to phone his doctor for blood pressure tablets so that it brings it down again so it's a case of keep monitoring but yeah at least we've finally got, got an answer of why he's so tired all the time and why he kept going dizzy Like I said before, though, he does get fed up because every time he goes to hospital for one thing, they find another problem and he's getting fed up on it. Hi, Kelly. Welcome, sweetie. Thank you, Jodie. No, you can't afford to burn it, can you? And I was making a... Um, cherry and apple crumble as well because Alex loves crumble, any crumble and I was making that and suddenly we got smoke all the way through bungalow and I thought what the heck's going off here it's only been in 10 minutes we shouldn't have all this smoke went in and it, had, it were black inside the dish there were no juice left in it um, there were, there were just nothing, it were charcoal, the, all of it. I thought, oh God, what's the way over now? Mm. 
And I thought it might have been a one-off, but we put some chicken in um, day after and it did it again. Come out as charcoal lumps and it's only been in the oven for 15 minutes. So. No, I was not happy. So. That's another reason why I get no chance of saving for anything because as soon as I start saving, either some appliance breaks down or truck breaks down or something. It's like I'm jinxed. Right, I think I like that. That's like a, co a coffee colour. Yes liking that a lot uh, just making sure I've not missed anything Thank you, other. Right, so back to the dark sepia, and we'll go on again for another three strands. I'm doing three at a time, otherwise I'll forget what order I've gone with pencils. And I keep coming back over the ones I've done because there's still gaps. As and when I work out what extra tone I want putting in, whether it wants lighter or darker. My glasses keep trying to slide down my nose. Stay there, can't see. Tumba. Uh, thank you, Kenny. I like the glow on it. It looks really clean. And thank you, Ashley. Thank you, Louise. Thank you, Kelly. Hey, May. Welcome, sweetie. working on a large frog <laughs> you're glad it's not leaves <laughs> yeah get you with that I keep looking at all these leaves I've only managed to do them and it's took me two days to do them and I've got to do all them to do <laughs> leaves the bane of my life Dee Dee, welcome. Thank you very much. Thank you, Sherry. Van Dyke Brown.
Burnt sienna. Hey cat, welcome. And thank you, sweetie. I was so scared of doing this to start off with, but I wanted to push myself and challenge myself, and I'm happy I did because I've really enjoyed doing it. surprise yourself if you pu push yourself challenge yourself real rumba Hi Oliver. Yeah, what you want? You ready for your tea? Yeah. I'm gone a minute then. <laughs> right, I'm just going to have to go and feed Oliver Don't walk over my table Be back in a second guys oh. Come out then, let me get out oh, no. Good boy Where's your dish? There you go. What you left your dinner for? Come, back to your dinner. Sorry about that guys. Oh. 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 
Oh, I'm back. Have I missed anybody? Uh, good luck, April. <laughs> we used to have a dog like that. He didn't pick it up and throw it, though. He used to push it across the floor with his nose. <laughs> well, yeah, cats don't tend to stick to a time. It can be any time from 3pm to 7pm. And we're having five on them. They all feed at different times. So You're up and down like a yo-yo. Oh, <laughs> easy task. It is, it's easy task doing lightning and autumn. <laughs> Thank you, Corolla. Uh, sorry, we're feeding time at the zoo. Uh, Dundalk sepia, I want a little bit more burnt umber print in that. bit of Van Dyke. I'm back to Sienna Brown. Well, burnt sienna. Yep, five cats. We did have six, but we lost one in April or May this year. I can't remember exactly when it were. Yeah, so we, we're now down to five. There's only one we bought, rest, rest are all rescues, or handed to us because uh, people can't keep them any, any longer. Um, the eldest is 15. She came to us because her owner passed away. Um, and there were nobody else to take her in, so she came here. Then Teddy is six at a guess we don't know because he turned up uh, and we had no idea where he came from he, we put him on uh, lost animal uk which is a big uh, nationwide search engine thing that finds lost animals he were on there for two and a half years and nobody claimed him, so he's still with us. And then there's uh, Oliver, who you heard saying I'm hungry. He's three years old and he came to us uh, from a not a very nice home. So 
so he's a full rescue. And then there's Mittens, she's three and we bought her from a kitten as soon as she were eight week old. And then Joey is a year and five months no, a year and yeah, a year and five month old. And my, my friend, her cat accidentally got with uh, kittens, and she re-owned all of them. They had twelve in total, and she re-owned all of them except two. And she decided to keep one herself. And she asked me if I could take the other one in because she, nobody else had asked for him. So that's how we ended up with Joey. We call him Jar Jar Binks or Jojo Binks. <laughs> that is so cute. If it were left here, he'd take in every stray and every cat that weren't wanted, even though we can't afford it. So at some point I had to put my foot down and say, no, we can't take any more in. That's enough. <laughs> oh, I don't know because I've not had a clog gel pen. Hopefully, somebody else has answered you. That's a good tip, Louise. I never thought of rubbing alcohol. I'll keep that in mind if I ever get a clogged one then. I think they get more cranky as they get older. Dogs, cats, any animal. They do. They start off so cute and nice and <laughs> cuddly and then they just start with that stare <laughs> it bores into you <laughs> Esme's the same she's got everything on a routine and if you don't keep to routine she lets you know <laughs> You've got your hands full there, April. <laughs> Humans also. <laughs> well, yes, I suppose we all do at some point. <laughs> right, dark sepia again.
Alex goes back to school on the 7th of September, they're reopening the schools. And he can't wait because he wants to go back with his friends. Nobody lives close to us, you see. So he, he hadn't seen them all locked down, all during COVID. All he's managed to do is keep talking to them on phone every day. And he wants to be back with his friends. He's looking forward to it. Me, not so much. Still worried about whether they're safe or not. But we'll see after they open and we get to see what measures they've put in place. turn a little bit guys Thank you, May. Yours is off on the seventh. Have they been doing the um, online homeschooling for past, God, how long has it been now? They broke up February didn't they? That's when schools shut. Wait, February? March. God my brain is so bad, I can't keep up. Hey Bethan! Sometimes I have to um, take the notification to, um, instead of it showing all, putting it down to show none and then put it back to show all again and it resets it. You also go back on 8th Mona. Pretty same as UK then. Um, somewhere else are going back on 3rd. Of September, they're staggering them all at all the uh, years of the secondary school at different times. Um, so some go back on third, some on uh, fifth, I think it is, and then others on seventh. Mm. Yeah, good to try, Beth, and it usually works for me. We're the same April. Um, all our schools sh shut though completely from March. But if they did have them open at any time, then we'd have said no because uh, Ian's elf. So Alex has been doing online learning. Well, right up until he started making money out of his drawings, and then the online learning were put on back burner. But his teachers said that that's all right because all they're going to do is repeat what they've been doing on homeschooling when they go back to school. So far he's sold five commissions. 
really pleased with him, but I wish he'd have carried on with doing school work at the same time, because I keep saying to him, you're going to find it hard trying to catch up. But they don't listen, do they? Kids, they get an idea in their head and they, won't, they don't listen to parents. We're just boring and trying to make their life boring. Seem to forget that we've been through it ourselves. That was a bit of Van Dyke Brown I put in. Now I'm putting burnt sienna. Bring a red tone in. Oh, thank you, Bethan. Yay, yeah, does a lot of drawing. Uh, all my kids uh, do drawings. Um, the other three do it. Well, let me start from the beginning. The older two do it for a hobby. They in between them working. Liam works, but he does coding on. Uh, discord so he gets his pleasure out of doing that and every now and again he'll do a drawing a fiasco but Alex has always drawn right from being little he's uh, 15 this year um, one of my videos if you look back it um, I've coloured one of his drawings. Um, I don't think there's a name of, for the picture, but in the title it does say colouring a picture that my son drew. Um, he does and drawing and digital drawing. Hi Debs, welcome. Yeah, that's the only trouble, isn't it, Kirsty? Timing it for um, going to different schools and coming out at end of day. You're running from one area to another. See, my oldest two, there's only a year between them. Um, so it weren't so bad because they were in the same school. But then you'd Liam came along eight years later and you were running about from one at one school to another. And then Ryan left, Liam was still at school and Alex came along so then I was running about from one school to another again. But now it's calmed down because there's only one left in school. <laughs> I don't mind so much in summer, but winter, sat at, freezing to death, waiting for him coming out of school. Because <laughs> you have to leave an hour earlier at his school to get a place to park. Otherwise you've got no hope. So he sat there for an hour, freezing to death.
I'm not going to put too much red in just yet. I'll just do a light coat. And then I've got the raw umber. It's too yellow. So I'm going to come back with the burnt sienna and go over it to redden it up a bit. I think that's better. It's not so yellow now. Each time I keep coming back to other bits and running a bit more colouring. Trying not to get rid of my highlights though, because that would be a disaster. Okay, Bethan. Oh, I'm sorry to that, Mona. That's not what you want. Numbers going up again. You have the same nightmare they had, Kirsty, as uh, April. I haven't looked for a long time what our numbers are. It got too depressing. Mm -hmm. Right. So, going back up the colours. Van Dyke Brown.
burn tumber. Just open this area a little bit more. Oh, cat. They all such should have been arrested. They insist that they need holidays and go into areas that still got it high and then they come back and refuse to follow the law. That's terrible. Oh, awesome, Della. Enjoy your pampering day. <laughs> no, I never wanted to be like my mum. <laughs> but every time I look at mirror now, I look like her, and I'm sure I act like her. So it's taking a little bit more to work out because it's got more light it's in it. Going to the raw rumber. Bye, Patty. 
Take care, sweetie. And thank you. <laughs> you do, cat. <laughs> Thank you, Mona. Hey, Shara. I didn't see you come in, sweetie. Hello. How are you doing? Gosh, time just flies again. It's right what they say, time flies when you're having fun. I keep looking at wrong monitor as well. I can't tell what's going off on that because it's all fuzzy and flickering at me. Thank you, Louise. Sorry, this is Van Dyke Brown. Oops, something on the leaf.
some banging going off outside. I wonder if somebody's got stuck and can't open the door. Take care, sweetie. Well, we're glad you're here, Debs. Lurker or not, all oh, everybody's welcome. Got a dark sepia. Filming darker areas in. to the burnt umber and just do over where I've darkened them bits. Van Dyke Brown. Bye Crowler. Take care sweetie. You stay safe too.
sienna almost done for today. Okay, May. Enjoy your day, sweetie. And thank you. It's been great seeing you. Enjoy the rest of your day. Rumba. screen a bit. Right. And then it needs to go back up to dark colours again to do more layers. Eventually it will look like the other side. that colour suits him I love grayscale I, I prefer grayscale to line art it gives you a map to follow thank you Heather Thank you, Mona. Have a wonderful day, sweetie. It's been nice seeing you. Thank you, Deb. That's true, Cat. You need to try different ones like I do. I keep alternating between uh, portraits and uh, Kirby Roseanne's I love my Kirby books always have done but I keep alternating and I've got I've got to a picture going at the minute that I'm doing I'm I've just started it on uh, Rhapsody in the Forest I'm doing that as a buddy colour we Kirsty I think it's Kirsty Correct me if I'm wrong, Kirsty, but I'm sure I'm d it's you I'm doing the colour, body colour with. <laughs> if not, you are now. <laughs> Thank you, Kat. <laughs> Thank you, Kenny. And Thank you for modding for me, Kenny. I don't know why your comments don't show up, Debs. <laughs> There's no wrong with yummy cupcakes. 
Yeah, go and lie down. Uh, can I? Have, enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you, Della. And everybody, take care of yourself. Stay safe and enjoy what you colour. And I'll see you soon. Bye for now.